Yo brother, it's time for us to start talking the real man. We've been sugarcoating too much, we've got to start calling everything out for what it is. Hey guys, I'm here with the commander and again a big shout out to Jason at eWheels for loaning me this wheel for an extended period of time of testing and I continue to love this wheel and I, I gotta say it's, uh, at least currently this is my favorite wheel I'm having the most fun with it most versatile wheel uh, but today I'm here to show you another upgrade that I'm going to be doing that to this and it has to do with these pedals these pedals that come with the uh, the commander uh, initially seem impressive but I would I would grade them as uh, mediocre at best they're not horrible certainly not great kind of okay they're very beefy that's for sure I mean <laughs> they sound really uh, stout and, and um, they're cast they have these large holes in here so I guess uh, dirt won't collect or snow <laughs> and they have these uh, supposed spiked uh, spikes on them but they're in reality they're these uh, small nubs which are kind of dull at the top so they provide realistically uh, very little traction and there's no grip of tape on these things uh, so to fix that I had to um, I added grip tape on the outside which helped for sure uh, let's see another issue with these pedals is they're they're very large which is good all depends on uh, your feet I suppose um, but for me they're I think they're just they're too big and they're and the, they're uh, they're not they don't have much of an angle so they they kind of lie closer to being flat so I actually added shims on the pedal hangers to give me a little more angle. So when I added that, added the grip tape, they became serviceable. Uh, no longer pedal scraping and my feet were staying on okay. Uh, but today I'm going to upgrade them. And what am I going to use? CNC pedals. Now these are from Chris Chappett and if you've a uh, follower of my uh, channel you'll know that I've been using Chris Chris's uh, pedal inserts for quite a while now he makes uh, spiked pedal inserts for any wheel that's made probably in the last four years so if you're riding a modern day EUC and you need spiked pedals uh, you can currently get the spike pedal inserts from Chris but he is branching out now to uh, actual CNC pedals, the full pedals. And uh, these things look great. So let me uh, pull you in closer and, and uh, show you more about them. All right, well, here they are. Now, I should say up front that these are not quite prototypes. They're very close to production, uh, but the set that... Um, Chris has given me here that they don't have the, the final fit and finish that you would uh, get when you buy yours if you choose to do so. But I think they're beautiful and uh, nothing like uh, CNC pedals, I tell you. <laughs> it feels so solid and the, the quality and uh, never going to break like cast pedals uh, can. But let me go through why these are, uh, well, Let's see, these are, Chris is calling these uh, modular semi-custom pedals. And uh, why is that? Well, they're semi-custom because you can choose a lot of options when you purchase these. And they're modular because the base, which gets attached to your pedal hanger, is separate from the foot plate. And you can see they're attached with four bolts. This allows you to potentially uh, change out the plates uh, without having to change the pedal hanger. 
And let's say you buy these to fit a particular wheel. You like the plates, you, you upgrade to a different wheel that these no longer fit, give you the, maybe the same angle, you would be able to get new, a new base and keep your existing plates. Or again, you could have multiple plates. I'm not sure what the use case for that would be. If you want to ride and uh, depending on the kind of riding you want to do, you want to change out the, the plate, you could do that. Uh, they're semi-custom because of the features that you can change. So these come with their own their own rods. If you want titanium rods, Chris can provide those for you. Uh, by the way, you'll notice here that they're, well, you can't tell right now, but these require no spacers. So these are beefier because of that, and therefore more support on the rod and not have to deal with uh, spacers when you take these on and off if you ever have to. Uh, let's see, uh, these things, these plates for instance come with uh, 12 so-called spikes. Chris has come with 28. You'll see that these attachment bolts grow th through the pedal here. Now in this case they're stubs but um, in the shipping version these are going to be mach machined to match the cone head set screws so that these will act as spikes also. But again Cust semi custom, right? If you don't like, if you're a fan of the stubs versus the spikes, uh, these could all be uh, flat set screws instead of the cone shape. I know of one user who decided they didn't like the, the these uh, holes, so in that case, Chris uh, just machined indentations instead of the in all these places, but they're not uh, not through holes. So that's something you can choose. You can choose the length and the width of the pedals. So in my case, let me put this here. You can see the approximate size of the, the pedal versus this default pedal. They're a little bit shorter, and most importantly for me, they're about three quarters of an inch narrower compared to these guys. So when I ride, my ankles are kind of touching barely brushing up against the shell. So all this material is just overhang and that's just excess material that's gonna potentially hit things and I don't want that. So with these pedals, the ability to, to pedal scrape should be uh, non-existent and much better for rock clearance and debris when you're running, riding a single track, so forth. You'll see that these are not uh, chopped off like like uh, these pedals, for instance. It's, it's a little thing, but Chris thinks that this this has uh, increases your chances of getting uh, debris, brush, and branches caught in here uh, versus this. A little thing, but I suppose that's true. And uh, I guess that that's it in terms of custom uh, customability. <laughs> of these pedals. Again, I love the look and uh, I love the ability to customize the plates to fit just your needs. All right, let me install these. shim to get the angle since this angle is made specifically for what I need or want. spacers which is really nice and 
And that's it. Now I should point out that on these plates I have, there is obviously no magnet, so they won't stay up. So Chris plans on um, installing a rare earth magnet here, uh, milling a space for the magnet to be um, inserted. And uh, that'll hold up the pedals just fine. I want to say that I have no financial interest in the success or failure of uh, Chris's pedal endeavor. Uh, the only thing I'm guilty of is being a friend of Chris. And, uh, and I do like to highlight uh, quality products of all, of all uh, types on my channel uh, as they apply to EUCs. And I like to uh, make you guys aware of them. Uh, so that's my goal here. So if you are interested in uh, some uh, semi-custom pedals made just to your specifications, uh, reach out to Chris. I'm sure he'll be able to help you. Now for price, I last time I talked to him, I, I don't think he's established a firm uh, price yet, but they're going to be in the $200 range. Definitely competitive with all the other CNC pedals out there. Uh, but unlike all the others that I'm aware of, uh, uh, these are semi-custom, and you can really get them to fit your foot perfectly. All right, well, you know what I'm going to do? It's mid-January. It happens to be a beautiful day in Southern California, mid-70s. I'm going to pack this guy up and take it up in the mountains right now. So in a few seconds, you'll see me on the trails and uh, give these guys a, a little workout.
Ah. Well, so far, pedals are just what I had hoped they'd be. Ah, it's nice to have quality pedals on the Commander. I've ridden for um, about 1,200 miles uh, <laughs> on these cra the crappy stock pedals. I mean, when you compare them to these, those are crappy. <laughs> like I said, they're, o they're okay pedals, but um, I think anyone who has a Commander would appreciate some better pedals. Boy, look at this view. Just gorgeous today in uh, Southern California. The clouds, the clarity. I don't know if you can see, wow, that glint. That's the Pacific Ocean. Uh, there's LA, Los Angeles. Yeah, just uh, just gorgeous, gorgeous day to be riding. Time to continue. Well, I hope you can uh, appreciate the trail riding I'm doing. At least you uh, trail riders out there. And uh, you probably can't tell, but uh, I'm climbing uphill on a 4,500 foot climb. This is to uh, Mount Wilson. I'm actually uh, 
I didn't start till three o'clock, so sun sets in a couple hours. I'm probably not going to go too much farther before I turn around, but uh, whew, this section of the trail is a <laughs> good test. Pedals are just what I was uh, expecting them to be like. Fantastic grip and uh, zero slippage, which is a wonderful feeling and absolute beautiful uh, rock clearance because the pedals don't extend beyond my my shoes uh, so that's a confidence builder too when you're coming up when you're dodging rocks and stuff all right guys well i hope you found this uh video useful and again if you're interested in uh, some custom pedals for your wheel or wheels <laughs> reach out to Chris. I'm not sure when he's going to be shipping these, but uh, probably first come, first come, first out, as they say, or something like that. <laughs> but uh, yeah, reach out to Chris and he'll be able to help you out, I'm sure. All right, guys, until next time, good riding. Ba -da -da -da. Ba -da -da -da. What if we could plan it out, Cabo for a week? Pass for a day, ooh wee wee You can come and be my babe, you can see What a gentleman I am, yeah What if we could plan it out Party in the streets Like the golden days at the beach Family buzzing in my air like a beat Maybe you could chill All this stuff I have up in my head I just wanna do Maybe if you come then you can hang You can meet the crew We could even chill out at the park Like we did in school Take you back to when you was a kid Everything was cool Hope you never lose track Life's a little hard when you're not home, yeah Yeah, I've been going and going But still on my own, yeah I'm a soldier, I fight for what's right So my heart's just been fighting for you What more can I do? I just wanna put you in a box like some Keep you to myself, you know I don't wanna share no options If I finally tell the truth Then I'm telling it to you What if we could plan it out Cabo for a week Pass for a day, ooh wee wee You can come and be my babe, you can see What a gentleman I am, yeah What if we could plan it out Party in the streets Like the golden days at the beach Family buzzing in my air like a bee Maybe you could chill Annyeong haseyo Shawty you been there for sin for real Tell me how it feel To be the one I meet I Only need a week with you baby You so bad I cannot speak Shawty where you been at I wish I known you sooner So we hit the mat like judo But I guess it's all okay though Cause we jumping on a plane You a starless to some pesos On my mind like I'm insane You my babe We can go wherever you want I got lemon in my water And these ropes that you got on Make me feel like I'm the man But I can't wait to put you on We could kick it with this four course meal And this nice red wine Don't hold it all inside You my number one